200,000 people demanding independence fill Barcelona on the National Day for an eighth year in a row. Hello, this is Catalan News in 100 seconds. 600,000 people, according to local police, took to the España Square and six streets leading to it in Barcelona for the annual pro-independence demonstration on September 11th. It was the eighth successive national day with a mass pro-independence demonstration, but this is the lowest figure to date, with the second lowest being some 900,000 in 2016. Today's protest took place against the backdrop of the upcoming verdict for the jailed pro-independence leaders. I think if they get a guilty verdict, it means that they can send anyone to jail for whatever reason they want. They hear there are lots and lots of people coming from many places, and I think that for Spain, they are really scared of us. Earlier in the morning, most parties took part in the customary floral tribute to the Catalan leader at the time the country lost its sovereignty in 1714. Today, pro-referendum leaders accused Spain of repression, while in Congress, in Madrid, the Spanish president said that not all Catalans can enjoy the National Day anymore. Aquesta diada és una altra mostra enorme de la determinació dels catalans a decidir el seu futur lliurement. Aquelles majories existents avui al país i que es demostraran en aquesta diada que diuen que no volen la repressió, que volen una solució democràtica. On més enllà de les opinions que puguem tenir cada un de nosaltres, eh, hem de denunciar que avui hi ha líders socials i polítics a la presó. Ojalà un dia llegue en el que la diada sea la fiesta de todos los catalanes y todas las catalanas y no de una parte de los catalanes. Meanwhile, the Ciutadans party unveiled a poster in the center of Barcelona with a message saying, we are all Catalonia now and always. We hope you've had a happy National Day and see you tomorrow.